Welcome back to Love and Junk. I'm Laura. I'm John. Today we have a super exciting popcorn edition for you. We love popcorn. This is Boom Chicka Pop. All right, so we're at Big Lots. That's where we got them at. We saw these. Have not seen these flavors anywhere else, I don't think. No, we've said this before in a video. We don't go to Big Lots very often, usually around patio time, like spring, and then again for the holidays to see what they have that's new and different. Yeah. And these jumped out at us. I don't know because we haven't been on the hunt for new popcorn flavors. These we practically tripped on. They were out in the open. Yeah. So they, you know, Big Lots doesn't have a ton of food for the holidays. So what they have is out loud and proud. So it doesn't get swallowed up by right. everything else. So I'm sure that they have these also at Walmart and other places. I don't know. It, you let us know if you've seen them elsewhere, but these are their new holiday inspired yeah. flavors Angie's, for this year. Oh yeah. Sorry. Uh, Angie's Boom Chicka Pop. We have hot cocoa marshmallow flavor and frosted sugar cookie. So <laughs> here's <laughs> where we're at with this. Like we love popcorn. We talk about popcorn more than people should probably. <laughs> we love, we what make. Does popcorn talk about us? I don't, probably does. Uh, we make ours in a stir crazy. So there's oil in the bottom and it pops the popcorn and you know, you know what a stir crazy it's is, good. I'm sure. But, um, we so we make it at home we love movie theater popcorn yeah. we love caramel corn and we make that ourselves sometimes packaged popcorn is great and sometimes not so much yeah we've it's, had some good ones a couple of these flavors i mean this flavor in particular is a little scary to me yeah hot cocoa marshmallow it there's a picture of one of the kernels on the front and it looks like it's drizzled so yeah so I, I think frosted sugar cookie we should do first this is a kettle corn and I feel like it's less palate coating Let's versus chocolate do right? it. sugar cookie kettle corn I'm gonna help you with that that sounds like it's gonna be good there you go thank you we got these for two dollars and 79 cents I wanted a paper right. towel. Oh, you want a paper towel. Okay. There you go. Thank you. Okay, so nothing to see. Not really. There's a little, little color to it. Specs. Let me get a little shot here. Not photo. A video. Hmm. It smells not like caramel. Kind of. Kind of like caramel corn. Similar. Oh yeah. Very it sweet good. smelling. Yeah, it does smell good. Okay. One of these with some of those red flecks on uh -huh. it. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. I don't hate it. I kind of like it. Yeah, it's not my new favorite. So I don't love it more than caramel corn for sure. But I love it like much more than regular kettle corn. Mm -hmm. It's really good. I don't know what says sugar cookie though. I don't either. I mean, it is frosted. There is some sort of drizzle on there. And then there's like the, um, that, like pinkness to it is the sugar. Mm -hmm. um, so it is like a sweet popcorn. It reminds I mean, me of corn typically is, but right. It reminds me of the kind of popcorn balls that are kind of coated with some marshmallow like yeah. sweetness. It's kind of reminiscent of that when you get a piece that's super coated. I like it. It's really good. I, I like it. But again, where's the sugar cookie? Yeah. It would be nice if it had like bits of sugar cookie that were in there and yeah. with like the drizzle and some of the other stuff. But Because mm -hmm. um, there's always two criteria when we try. Well, there might be more than that, but. It's just a um, guessing game out here. But. Uh, when we try something new, does it taste like what it sa says it is? And do we like it? Right. I don't really feel like it. If I were blindfolded, I would never say frosted sugar cookie. 
Definitely something in the sweet genre, but probably not frosted sugar cookie. Yeah, I wouldn't have said cookie at all. But I like it a lot. Okay. Two. All right. Here comes the Boom Chicka Hot Cocoa Marshmallow. Also for two seventy nine. Hot cocoa marshmallow. Whoa, we got some drizzles. I know that even like very high end shops will have chocolate, caramel, drizzly bits with nuts and toffee and different things in it. I know that that's a thing, but I'm not the biggest fan of that. Chocolate and popcorn is not my favorite. Right. Caramel and popcorn, on the other hand. So I definitely want to get a piece that has chocolate on it. Oh yeah. I see what I want right there. Cheers. Cheers. I don't like that one as much. I don't like that one at all. Mm. It does, it, this one though does have like a hot cocoa flavor to it. It does. You know what it reminds me of? Uh, chocolate cereal. It does, yes. Mm -hmm. I've never been a fan of that. Me neither, but a <laughs> lot of people are. It's not horrible. No. But I wouldn't buy it again. I wouldn't either. I would get that again. I think that's good. I would too. But this hot cocoa marshmallow? Mm -mm. Where's the marshmallow? In the coating? I thought there would be bits of marshmallows. There's a white drizzle on it as well. Oh. Um, I think that's that's the marshmallow. Yeah, that tastes like sweet and cereal all day. Chocolate sweet and cereal. I guess, you know, the problem that I have with it is the hot cocoa part. If it was just chocolate and it tasted like chocolate, I think it would be better, but they go overboard, I think, in trying to make it taste like hot cocoa, mm -hmm. and it's not as good. Yeah. There you have it. So. Sorry. How would you rate them? Um, if caramel corn is a 10, that's yeah. your favorite, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. Um, let's see. I'd probably give the... Frosted sugar cookie is seven because it is it is good. It's really good. I, I would eat it. Mm -hmm. um, I would probably give the hot cocoa marshmallow maybe a four. Okay. I think I'm around seven and a half-ish and a five. This isn't horrible. Like, we have to throw it out. Would I put it out for company? Absolutely. It's quality. It's a good product. It's just not our vibe yeah. that we like. The only thing that would really make this worth, well, I wouldn't say the only thing, but one thing that would, it kind of gives me the same vibes, is, is like a peppermint. Like, just don't make it holiday flavor just to make it holiday flavor. It has to taste good. There, yeah. and there are, um, I feel like we tasted some last year I, that are chocolate and candy cane. Yes, came. we did. Mm -hmm. It was a little bag, and I can't remember the brand. Um, we saw the brand. Yeah. Not that long ago at Dollar Tree. Yeah, I can't remember. Oh, wow. Well. Anyway, holiday popcorn. Is it a thing? It is to us. It is a thing. But... It, it's definitely a thing in our house. In fact, a lot of times around the holidays, we make our caramel corn and have that set out. We have one more popcorn that we found that's very strange that I had no idea was a thing. We'll be trying that in an upcoming video. So make sure you're subscribed to our channel so that you don't miss out all of the holiday content. We are going to be doing some advent stuff, holiday beverages. We just picked up some holiday tea. Chan's been doing his coffee stuff. We're gonna do some hot chocolate, lots of recipes. So make sure you're subscribed and hit that bell. Ding. So that you are notified when our new videos go up. Also go to the comment section and check out the link to subscribe to this channel as well as our game channel if you're into that sort of thing. We're gonna be doing some holiday games over there. One of the things that we're putting together, well, not putting together, we're trying to figure out how to film, but we have an escape from oh, yeah. the gingerbread house game that we're gonna be playing over there, like an escape room type game that we're gonna play with all of you very soon. So make sure you come check us out over there. Yep. Now, if you love Boom Chicka Pop, which there is a company that is after my own heart. I don't always love what they put out, but they're always changing it up, which I oh, for sure. love and appreciate. Yeah. Um, sometimes it's a hit, sometimes it's a mess. That's really, you're gonna have that, right? 
uh, or popcorn in general, or us. Or the, the video. video. Or the holidays. Yeah. Give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps. I can't put my thumb up. It really helps our channel when you do that. That's all we have for today. See you next time. Bye, guys.